What do you think is responsible for your success? My father. Because of everything he taught you? Absolutely. How would you describe what he was like? Well, he was, he was a, he was a tough, hard-working golf pro. And he learned both ends of the business the hard way, by experience and by personal uh, work and, and, and fun. And, uh, and he was tough. He never, he never let up. He stayed tough uh, all his life. And by a matter of fact, I think about it, uh, he died a tough guy. He played 27 holes of golf the day he passed, and he was tough. What do you think you most learned from him? Oh, he was honest, and uh, he was probably as honest uh, as I've ever seen anyone. He, he said it the way it was. He did it the way it was. Uh, he, he helped everybody he could. Uh, he contributed. Uh, probably the toughest guy that he dealt with was his son. Uh, Why did your father say you were uh, his worst hire ever to run the golf pro oh, shop? Well, he picked on me. Uh, as I said, his son, uh, he was tough on me. He, he never backed off. Uh, he uh, he played tough, worked hard, and died hard. Um, b between growing up in the Depression, having, you know, not a lot of money when you were younger, and even those early tour days when, you know, funds were scarce, what did that teach you about savings? Well, of course, in my family, my father and our, and our family, uh, had no money most of our early lives. We, we would come out and hunt rabbits and pheasants and, uh, and take them home and my mother would soak them in salt water overnight and, and we'd eat them the next day. And that was great stuff. Uh, but that was part of all of the education. Uh, and, and my father, when he bought uh, groceries. If he didn't have enough money to pay for it, I, I remember him scraping up enough money to go pay the bill, and and he did, and he he, he sacrificed the things that he liked to pay the bills for groceries that we ate, and, and that was his life. That was the way he lived in the early days, and and of course he told me how he appreciated uh, the fact that he was lucky enough to be a golf pro and to uh, be able to make a living doing what he was doing. For more clips from this interview, visit GrahamBensinger.com.